What? We need your name in your role. Oh. So Lika Proctor or O'Neill and I play Ali Bertke. What do you do outside of end times? I um I draw and I go to the Art Institute of Seattle and be an animator. Um, I work on a bunch of projects from my like, cosplay to lots of stuff. If you could play any other character in End Times, which would it be? God, I should say the archivist because that is a really cool role. Just the idea. I mean, seems simple at first. You're not moving around a lot, but it's really kind of a deep role. I think Kim plays it really well. Tell us about your character and how they've changed since last season. So how has Ellie evolved? Well, for one, before I came back, kind of had to uh, think about the character and develop it a different way. Um, I feel like I played a better military kind of role and that I was able to focus more on the Burke kind of stronghold and how they view their, their people and their, their family. <laughs> um, I feel like it became more intense um, and I also feel like I understand that Ellie's more not centered, say, on herself, but more what other people give to the Burke family. What do you love about your character? I think, I just say I kind of love her stance. You know, the way that, not like physically, but her stance above everybody. The way that she, it's kind of, you know, sad, but the way that she views being just, you know, above everybody. Why do you hate about your character? <laughs> um, at the same time, I also hate that exact same thing because it's kind of horrible. But it's such an interesting, like, three-dimensional character piece that it, you can both love it and hate it at the same time. What's something that you made up about your character that isn't necessarily in the script? That Alex doesn't know about? Oh. Well, Alex does know about it because we talked about it last time, but that's okay. because Kim brought up um, the, the possibility of um, when she lost her ability to walk and she had the, um, the horseshoe. We were talking about the scene where Ellie gives, where Ellie possibly gives the horseshoe to Kim to hang on to, um, well, to the archivist character, and she, the reason that Kim thought about it would be like, her character, she thought about it like um, Ellie needed to get her away, so she had to give her the horseshoe instead of hanging onto her hand. But the way I thought about it was Ellie thought that she's no longer useful. If you were going to spend an afternoon with Ellie, what would you do? Hide. <laughs> Especially at the end of season one, which pulled off really well. Maddie patience. and Ellie. <laughs> Just Maddie and Ellie, because I'd be terrifying and in two different time zones. What are you excited about in season two? I'm excited to watch it. <laughs> For one, I'm excited to go up on YouTube, show everybody that it's an awesome show, and just finally see how the pieces come together. Until the end. <laughs>